I am the math lobster. You know that certain animals mate for life. Dolphins, some birds, some humans. Do you think that lobsters mate for life? Well, they don't. And who knows why? Maybe it's because the females have so many thousands of eggs. We're going to be finding out about factor pairs for whole numbers. Here's some simple tricks that you may or may not know. Multiples of 2 and 5. If a number ends in 2, 4, 6, 8, or 0, then 2 is a factor, or that number is a multiple of 2. Let me give you some examples. Let's try 14. It ends in 4. Divided by 2 is 7. Let's try one with 6. 26 divided by 2. 2 goes into 2 once, 2 into 6, 3. Let's try one with 8. 38. 38 divided by 2. 2 goes into 3 once, and 1 left over. 2 goes into 18, 9. As you can see, numbers that end in 2, 4, 6, or 8 are multiples of 2. And these are the two factors. 2 and 7 are factors of 14. 2 and 19 are factors of 38. You could try some more. Let's try them with, how do we know if a number is a multiple of 5? Well, it will end in a 5 or a 0. Let's try 45. 45 divided by 5. What times 5 is 45? 9. Very good. Let's try a bigger number. 70. 70 divided by 5. Now you can count up. 5, 10, 15, 20, or you can think long division. 5 goes into 7 once, and 2 left over. 5 goes into 20 four times. There are many, many factors, many multiples of 5, but remember they always end in 0 or 5. Why do I know that? Because I'm the math lobster.